Hello my friends, you've seen incredible content on this channel, and here's more. In a previous version, I've analyzed the images I've taken over South and North Dakota, but this time I decided to use Meta Shape to see if it can remove the lens distortion. And it has done pretty good. Now there was a slight curve, but I realized the ground around this area has different elevations. Let's have a look. Using Google Earth, we can hover over different areas and look at the bottom right. It tells us the elevation. So there north of uh, that uh, city, Sioux Falls, we see uh, that uh, the ground has slightly higher elevations. So the difference is about, I don't know, 600, 500 uh, feet or so. And uh, we'll use this in this analysis. Now look at this. As we know, the Earth is extremely flat. Now this photogrammetry software is pretty good, but uh, we see a lot of noise in the distance. And that's due to the atmospheric turbulence. Um, and so it's to be expected. The spherical model of the Earth at about 300 miles uh, predicts an 11 mile drop from a flat tangential plane. And obviously that is not the case here. The world is incredibly flat, my friends. And the illusion that we live on a globe is due to upward refraction. Every time I drive back to California to visit family and friends, God reminds me of this wonderful truth that he has hidden from the wise. I see the spreading colors in the sky and he just leaves me in awe of God's wonderful creation. Always believe, my friends, all the answers are there. Right in front of us, God's world is truly flat, my friends. Stay true to the faith, and uh, hopefully I will see you again. Who knows, my life is in God's hands.